why is it that we're trying this revisionist history? If if Stanton would hit somehow hit sixty two home runs, that now we're looking at would that be the new home run mark? And I went, you, 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 sorry, and you know we we've already we we closed the book on the steroid uh, era here. Well, maybe, but why why, are, why is this a conversation that all of a sudden Stanton has a chance to uh, you know uh, surpass Roger Maris here as the single season home run uh, champ? Yeah, that's the shame of the steroid era, man. It's just that there's not enough legitimacy to those records. Now, that being said, those are records. They're not going to change, right? The home run record is 73. You get the whole list with Bonds, McGuire, Sosa. No one's changing that. But in the minds of fans, it will always be there. So if you want to say that you buy into authenticity more for Stanton than you do Bonds, you can do that as an individual fan. He's not going to get the record if he hits 62 home runs, but there's a lot of people who are going to say, you know, I have, I have more appreciation for what Stanton did than for what Bonds did, and I would be one of them. The Dan Patrick Show, weekday mornings on Audience.